Hi YouTube, Tim Unkert from UnkertEducation.com here. In this video, we're going to install the Dart SDK on a Chromebook. So the first thing we want to do is enable the Linux development environment. So we can go over to the launcher here, and to enable, enable the Linux development environment, we'll find our settings, and on the left-hand side of our settings, we'll go to Advanced. From here, we'll click on Developers, and then Turn On, and then Next, and Install. This will take a few minutes to install, so I'll come on back when it's done. When Linux is installed, a terminal will pop up. I'll maximize the terminal and increase the font size so you can see what I'm going to do next. I want to make sure everything is up to date, so I'm going to type sudo apt get update, and then two ampersands, which stands for and, and then sudo apt get dist dash upgrade with a dash y flag at the end and I'll hit enter. Now that Linux is installed we can minimize our terminal here and I'm going to open up a browser and search for the dart.deb file and hit enter. You'll see this get the dart SDK come up. I'll click on that and I'll go down here and click on Linux and install a Debian package. Quick note, this should work for Intel and AMD processors. I don't have an ARM processor, so I can't speak to that. We're going to click on this, and it gives you this install a Debian package. Alternatively, download the Dart SDK as a Debian package in the .deb package format. I'm going to click on that, and that's going to begin the .deb download. Once the .deb file is downloaded, you can click Show in Folder or go to your Downloads folder. I'm going to right-click and click Install with Linux, and then Install and OK. OK, it says it's installed, and to verify the installation, we can open up our terminal, type dart hyphen hyphen version, and hit Enter. And you'll see that it gives you a dart SDK version, which will probably be different at the time that you watch this video. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.